Hi guys, uh, we're back with another edition of More Some More Moment, back in our regular space. Um, today we're actually doing a video because we have just come to 12 months of vlogging on YouTube. Um, so we thought we'd bring you a video where we talk about 12 different aspects of a once and more suit. So when you guys come in and you're picking your suits and designs, here's 12 of the different aspects that you can actually customize and uh, make for yourselves. Number one is the cut. Now we tend to have a characteristic um, cutaway at the bottom of our, every one of our jacket. We do offer another more standard option, however, we like to go with the nice cutaway. It is a key characteristic of a more and more suit. So when you see a lad or a gent walking around with a suit, legend, no. got a nice cut at the bottom of his jacket, yeah, that's more than likely gonna be more and more. More than likely. Yeah. Secondly, is the breast, single or double? The difference between single and double breasted is a single breasted jacket is one which just literally buttons up like this, like both of us are wearing. Whereas a double breasted is the one that wraps over. So first one that way, second wraps over. Number three, the amount of buttons. Oh. Yeah. Most business jackets will have two buttons on them. Most casual jackets, one. Most old school guys or taller gents will tend to go for three. So I mean, it all depends on what your, what your, um, your, what your persuasion is, should I say. Yeah. Also, if you've got yeah. a bigger belly as well, you would tend to go for a free button because what that also does is it makes sure that the top comes in more. So sometimes because of the shape of your body, you also need to go for a free button. Number four, the lapel. Notched, peaked, or shawl. Those tend to be the three main ones we go for. Okay, yeah. And you, uh, Joshua's got a peak lapel on today. I've got a notch lapel, and then the shawl lapel is the more rounded ones that you find on tuxedos and dinner jackets and things of that nature. Number five, the amount of pockets you have in your jacket. Mm. Right, it sounds, it sounds quite silly, you think, what do you mean amount of pockets? But it's quite a few different ones you can add. Cashmere under the collar. I mean, a lot of guys tend to see me walk around with my black suit. I tend to have like a little bit of a yellow cashmere under mine. It tends to, tends to pop through a little bit. It's a nice little feature on there. So I mean, changing the color of the cashmere under your collar. It's another thing you can add, which can make your suit unique to something else that's out there. Mm -hmm. The working cuff. Yeah, uh, working cuff is... It's pretty much that. Yeah. The lapel buttonhole, and also stitching on the lapel buttonhole, and stitching on the buttons on the cuff. Yeah, so again, something that you can customise. Yeah. Um, yeah, Joshua's got a black one there. I also have a black one under my lapel in here. Number nine is the vents on the back of the jacket. As standard, we pretty much advise most people to go for the double vent because it just sits well on everybody. Single vent, you know, some people are like, that's their persuasion, that's the only thing that they want to work with. Um, or you can go for no vents at all on the back but then that really makes the jacket quite stuffy. Number 10 yeah. is the breast pocket shape. Most breast pockets you'll see will come either straight or at an angle, or you have the barquetta pocket, which is one which has more of a rounded shape to it. Number 11, belt loops or side adjusters. It's all a preference thing really. Some guys love to wear belts with their trousers. It's just that, just the way it is. If you're not wearing a belt, what's the point of having belt loops? Right, so then that's what we that's where the trouser fasteners come into play. We're now on number 12, and number 12 is talking about turn ups. And everyone should know what a turn up is on the foot of the trouser, and that is our 12 different aspects of a more some more suit or a tailored suit. But you only want us to think about more some more suits, anyhow. So, um, mm -hmm. we hope you've learned something new. There are obviously other elements to our suits that you can still customize. We didn't talk about things like linings and uh, you know the types of buttons and so forth. So there's a lot more that you can still do with your suits. Um, so come into more some more, have a consultation and find out more. Um, and yeah, until next time, make sure that you like, comment, subscribe and share this video click that like button to send any questions that you may have over to ask at moltonmore.com and yeah for those of you who have been following us for the last 12 months thank you very much continue to do so and we hope we continue to entertain you
too low. So it should be. Alright. Also, it's a. Uh, oh my god. What's the word I'm looking for? It's. Yeah. As standard, we pretty much always advise people go for the double breasted. It just sits well for everybody. Double breasted. Sorry. Yeah. Soon as Joshua's leading, you now I'm going to take over. Alright. So, uh, all you have the full correct pocket. Okay, one second. I'm going to make sure I'm saying that right. Come into more, some more, have a consultation. Consultation. Like, turn <coughs> There's no other way. <coughs> Anytime you're finishing ruining my moment. <laughs> yeah, who's going to try anyway? 